So could you say like Akon was the one to kind of help put you on the business side of music? No, I f Akon. But the business side, I learned all myself. Oh, Self-taught. So yeah, you had to sure. go through some L's to figure out the difference. I didn't go through L's in music. Because mm. I, I know how to navigate. I know how to read contracts. Like a lawyer will be telling me some shit. And I'd be like, nah, that don't sound right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah. Yeah. And then I make niggas bust shit down to simple form because I don't know contract language. Yeah, because they put all them little, 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 little words in there, the <laughs> language in there be like so difficult. There you go. Yeah, it's just like break it down to where I can understand it real quick. Yeah. And then once they break that down, it's be like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Take then that I get out. it. Because I want to yeah. see straight numbers. What, what's your percentage? What's mine? Yeah. All right, if I don't come through, what happens? If uh-huh. you don't come through, what happens? What's the exit plan of out this bitch? You know what I'm saying? I keep shit simple. All this extra talking lawyers be doing and all that extra shit, because the lawyer done let me in straight when I did the deal with uh, Bird, man. I don't, it wasn't the best deal, but I fought with Stunner. I was just going to ask you about yeah. that when you read that contract. You feel me? What, like, what, what did you see in there that, you know, that stood out? That bitch was just long as fuck, and I trusted the lawyer <laughs> to read that bitch. I was like, what? Yeah. It was 50 pages. Yeah. Now, that ain't nothing on Stunner, though. We know Stunner is love. Yeah. It's yeah. just how they do business. Mm-hmm. But I was like, you got to be the exception to the rule. So my next deal, guess what? We're going to bust this bitch down to two pages. Everybody understands what's going on. Because don't it sound crazy? Me and you talking to each other, uh-huh. but our lawyers saying something different to each other. Mm. Yeah. We they got a whole nother language yeah. going. <laughs> we they, don't intend yeah. to do good business. Yeah, they got, they got a whole nother language going. I'm like, huh? Somebody's trying to get over. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Then I'm, they go to emailing each other. There you go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so you got to have good business. I'm like, man, me and you going to sit here. We're going to iron this out. Then we tell the lawyers what we want. Uh-huh. You get what I'm saying? But no, the stunner, stunner did good business because he let me write out my contract. Give me X, Y, Z, boom, I gave it to him. We up out that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Oh, uh, you felt like it just wasn't a good contract at all, though. Huh? Well, I didn't want to go through um, Republic System. Like, oh, okay. I'm, that's a major label. You don't know the CEO. I could have met uh, Monty Lipman probably. You know what I'm saying? That's who, I think that's who over Republic. But um, once you get in there, that's too much power over you. You want to keep your own power and empower yourself. You know what I'm saying? And keep your leverage going. There you go. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Thank now, you. could they have made me a probably an ex- insane international superstar? Maybe, maybe not. Because a lot of niggas who sign to these majors who get shelved. Shelf, yeah. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? But I ain't feel like doing that. You know what I'm saying? So, but with, with, with Empire, like, you know, what's the pros and the cons with Empire? Um, I just look at it as, shit, I'm right here with the CEO. You know what I'm saying? We a partnership. And then whatever we say is what it is. It ain't. It don't be no, we got to have arguments and this and that. Or if we do shit, it gets settled right then and there. You know what I'm saying? It ain't no, I'm going to shelve you because yeah, I don't like X, you. Y, and Z. Yeah, yeah. it's more, nah, we're going to come to a common ground right now on the phone or right now here in person. Yeah, you know what I'm I, I see your guys' relationship, you and Ghazi, and it seems like you guys are like more than just, you know, label head and artists. You know, you guys Yeah, it's, a, part, really it's like a real that. partnership. Yeah. Like we did a partnership deal. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? So I keep way more of my catalog. And I keep almost all of my publishing. I had a publishing deal with Sony prior to this. I had to get myself out of that deal. Mm. But I called and negotiate. Well, I had a lawyer on that too as well. He was pretty cool. But still, I still got to tell niggas X, Y, and Z. Like, we not going for this. We not going for that. And then read this bitch over three, four times. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? It's a glitch in here somewhere. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so what was the origin story of, like, that relationship? Did you reach out to Ghazi or did Ghazi? Ghazi DM me. Cause mm. I put Ghazi's name in the song, mm. boom. So he came, boom. He had to, he offered me the biggest deal. Really? For sure. So you were still open to signing even after the I, two. He's more distribution with mm. a partnership. Right. It's, be, it's a better partnership. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you you were right. He be, he definitely hands on because I just seen him walking past us. You know what I'm there saying? There you go. <laughs> and I'm like, he in this motherfucker. Usually you wouldn't see no CEO owner or label doing anything. There you go. Or be not even be close to his artist to see what's going on, but he. He's definitely built an actual empire, man, that people respect. A lot of people respect him, you know, uh, in, in doing this, though. So that's actually crazy, yeah. man. I love that. I love that about him. For sure. I was, yeah. I was seeing you guys on Instagram, like, in some foreign land riding dune buggies and shit. Like. Oh, yeah. We was over in um, Qatar. It's right next to Dubai. Doha. Yeah. We went out there, shot some videos, business meetings. You know what I'm saying? Like, tech conferences. We be doing all that type shit. A lot too. of big money out yeah. there? Because we think money is rich out here in L.A., but that no 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 that's another level that's the richest country in the world yeah yeah that's another whole another that's some other shit super clean is it strict out there yeah it's strict out there that's the only reason I ain't like it because you can't have guns but I went to the shooting range you know what I'm saying like 
Yeah, tell me about that, because, uh, you know, I just uh, got something expunged, and I need my gun. <laughs> <laughs> 